everyone, hope you're well. So excuse my voice, I'm getting over a bit of a cold. Um, <clears throat> horrible. Um, but it's only lasted a few days, which is, is good. But yeah, if I sound a bit rough, I have been a bit rough, but I'm on the mend, it's just a little cold. The kids already had a little bit of a cold and I think I've just taken a little bit longer to kind of um, catch it. Also, the changing weather, you know, it's like one minute, like last week, it was back feeling like summer, 26 degrees, and today it's like 10 degrees. So yeah, my body just can't kind of keep up, I think. But anyway, as for the title, I'm going to be doing a birthday haul. Violet is approaching nine. <laughs> I can't believe it, honestly. She is such a cheeky, beautiful little girl. Like, honestly, she is just full on like although she's quite shy and quiet at home she's full on and she's such a girl she's a really girly girl which i absolutely love she loves her dresses and pink and glitter and makeup and girly stuff um which she just reminds me of myself exactly how i was at her age um maybe a little bit older actually they come and they kind of catch on to things a lot earlier i think or i feel like they do nowadays but yeah she reminds me of me so much um and yeah, I thought I would do a birthday haul. So um, her birthday isn't till another three weeks, but I really like to get on top of birthdays, especially because getting closer to Christmas, I don't want it to feel like a really big expense because obviously Christmas is coming up and Miles just had his birthday and then everyone else is in like May and then mine's in January. Um, this is kind of the busy time of year for us for birthdays. So a lot of this stuff I have bought like quite a while ago. But then I picked up the odd thing, like today I picked up the last item that she really, really wanted. So um, yeah, I'll try and leave everything linked in the description bar. And I hope this gives you some ideas, some inspiration for your little girls or boys or just anyone really, because there is some general stuff here. So the first thing I'm gonna start off with, which, oh my God, she has wanted for ages and this is kind of like the big item, even though it's not really the most expensive item, I would say. Um, she's wanted a Our Generation doll since last year, but <clears throat> I don't know, it was kind of a phase, you know what I mean? You know when they go through phases? So I managed to pick this one up from TK Maxx. They do them all in there for 20 pounds, they're 19.99. So about 10 to 15 pounds off the original price. This one is Vienna. She had little sandals on. I just thought she looked really cool, really cute. She's got a little leather jacket, a little tutu dress. She's got really lovely, beautiful brown long hair. And um, yeah, this is one thing that she's wanted. Her friends all have these Our Generation dolls. I think these are our version of the American doll. Um, and it's so typical because they've brought loads of new ones out. But um, anyway. If she just continues to play with them, I may get her one for before Christmas. Um, but yeah, that is one thing that she has been on and on about. And to be honest, like, they grow up so quick. I love the fact that she still wants dolls and she still wants to play with Barbies and dolls. Stuff like that, because it does get to a point, like Alistair, he's at that age where he just doesn't really play much apart from with his lego or just generally messing about but he doesn't really play with toys and stuff so um yeah that's her kind of like main gift that she really wants <clears throat> and then this item is one thing that she mentioned when this is new in to enter the entertainer or smith stores but i got it from the entertainer um it's just a random fail fix it's just a doll she puts on a mask and it changes her makeup, I think. There's loads of different designs and types. This was £20. Um, ideally, it's not something I would have generally picked up unless it's only literally because she pointed it out and she said that it's one thing that she wanted. So, um, yeah, I mean, you can style her hair. She loves all things makeup. It's a surprise fashion as well. So it's like a surprise outfit. You don't know what she's going to wear. So, um, yeah, like I said, they've got loads of different types. They've got one more expensive ones as well with extra accessories. But, yeah, this is one thing she wanted. So, they are two dolls. I got her a soft and snuggly, like, throw blanket. This has um, swans on it, like a swan design. And it's kind of pink and fluffy and cream. And she loves blankets. 
So this was only five pounds from B&M and they have loads of different designs, boys and girls. This is just the one that I thought was really sweet and not too babyish. So I got her that. And then from Primark, only got these the other day. Two pairs of cozy socks. She loves her socks. Um, I think they were 2 50 three pounds. Little pandas and little spotty ones. Okay, so I've got her a couple of these things for Christmas. I got them in the entertainer a little while ago. They were on offer. But she was going on about this sort of heart hatchimal that has two little hatches, patch animals in. So, um, yeah, I just put one towards her birthday. She has one to go into a stocking filler as well. But it's a heart, and I think there's like twins in there or something. But she does love her hatchimals, these little things. So, um, yeah, I got her that kind of like a blind bag surprise thing um i did pick this up today from tk maxx i just saw it randomly and i thought actually she'd probably like this it's a create your own crystal panda corn so it looks like this 7.99 you basically make this you decorate it there's just yeah it's quite um intricate it's for eight years plus so it's definitely not for the younger age so yeah you just kind of I don't know, it's some sort of activating crystal thing that you paint on and it kind of turns all crystal crystally. I think that would be a nice little crafting fair to do. $7.99, I thought that was quite good value. So that was from TK Maxx. Okay, last item with a couple of items inside. So this is getting onto like the girly bits. Every time we go into like B&M or TK Maxx, they've got loads of these little backpacks and she's just on and on about having just a little day-to-day -day backpack, I suppose, weekend backpack. I found this one, I just thought it was really sweet. It was in the reduced section for £12. I don't know how much it was originally from TK Maxx. Um, but yeah, it's just a unicorn rainbow. It's just really cute. It's got a little zip at the front. So um, yeah, that's another little item. And then I've just filled it with some little goodies. So the first thing I have filled it with is one of the LOL Happy Days. This is like one of the newer LOL things out. Um, I think it was £12, I believe. There's eight surprises in there. Um, yeah, it just kind of looks like a present. I just thought that was a super cute thing just to put in. She loves LOLs as well. So I put that in there. I put a new wet dry brush in. This one is a unicorn one. And this was 3 dollars from TK Maxx HomeSense. We have quite a few of these because they're just so good. I also put in a little clay mask. This one I think I got from Home Bargains for like 60p. She loves her little animal sheet masks, but I thought this one would be quite an interesting one because it dries hard and crispy on your face. Bit of fun. I also, from Tika Max Home Sense, I got her some mini nail polish collection. This is £4.99. And um, yeah, just look like that. Super girly. Lots of gorgeous like pastel colours and glitters. I thought she'd love that. And the last item, I think I got this from B&M, is just a hand sanitizer. I think this was a pound. She could just clip it on this bag or her, her other school bag or something. I just thought that was really sweet. And um, yeah, it's a nice size actually. It's a good, good size. Got um, a pocket on this side and then a zip on the front. So yeah, that is pretty much everything. I've got Violet for her ninth birthday. I really hope this has given you some ideas and inspiration. I'll leave everything linked and I will see you in my next video. Don't forget to check out all the other years because I do it for all the children. And um, you can look back. I think I've got a little playlist. And if I have, I will, again, leave it linked. Um, yeah, thanks so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.